Hey guys, it's Miss C, and today I am coming with, yes, yet another video. <laughs> um, today I'm coming with um, my, what's in my hospital bag, and my baby's diaper bag, which is really just her hospital bag. So, to keep this video as short as possible, gonna jump right into it. Um, I do have two separate bags, one is hers, one is mine. I'll start with my bag first. This is my duffel bag. Um, I got this bag from Walmart. I like four dollars. Um, okay. This is the bag open. It has like several different compartments, but this is the bag open. First, I have just like an outfit for me. Um, what do I have packed? Um, just a. This is gonna be kind of hard. <laughs> Harder than what I thought. I have um. A jogging suit. Pink velour jogging suit. Looking like a bottle of Pepsi up here, small. Um, I have several different shirts um, packed. Just all uh, depends on um, what I feel like. Got just a white tee. Got two white tees. Um, one for me. Just depend, like I said, what I feel like putting on. And one for um, my boyfriend. Uh, this bag here has underwear. I have, I think, three pairs of underwear. And these right here were actually like a pair of leggings slash tights, but they fit like biker shorts. So. My plan is to have pad, panty, biker shorts <laughs> to make sure don't nothing fall out, get loose or nothing. Put on a pair of panties. These all have like a tight fit. And then I guess I'll take these out much I see them. I think I got like I said three or four pair of panties in here. But This is what those leggings look like. Those will be like a girdle slash penny guard. Pants guard. Um, I have my sweatband. I actually bought this a couple of years ago. It's our sweatband. Gonna wear that. Try to keep everything in. Help my um stomach go back in. Even though I got all the stretch marks. Um, this here is just a big comfortable t-shirt. My granny gave me this, and I do wear it. Yes, I do. Um, got another bag. Got four pairs of socks in here. Although I will be wearing hospital socks because I love those. These are my favorite pajama pants, and they are going to be going with me. When I say these pants are probably, let me see, I think I got these Aeropostale, so I know I was a child. I ain't going to say a child, but a teenager. Um, you've been through the bleach stains, the holes, everything. I think I got these when I was like... 17. I'm 24. <laughs> yeah, those pants are not going anywhere. Got me a pair of gloves because it will more likely be cold. These are from Target. Aren't they so pretty? So, even though I don't plan on carrying a pumpkin seat out, that's for just in case. Just in case I want to leave him at the hospital and carry my baby myself. <laughs> um, this is another shirt to possibly wear up under my um 
tour with my jogging suit. Have an all black cami tank. Because I will be free balling and I will not be wearing a bra in the hospital. So, to keep everything contained, I got this nice little black cami. And this will be good for when I am trying to breastfeed. Excuse me. Um, although I probably will not use it, I did bring me some perfume. This is real soft. Um, I didn't want anything too strong because I don't want my baby sneezing all over the place talking about I'm making her nose burn. <laughs> so I got something real soft. I just don't feel complete unless I have perfume. So I got the cocoa butter set um, from Victoria's Secret. Last thing in that little compartment was a pack of gum. Then, if we go from the inside to this little zipper pocket here, this is where I have got both of our toothbrushes. Like these were at Target, these were uh, containers. Target? No, Walmart. I think they were like some 97 cents or something. I do have uh, some toothbrushes and toothbrush um, protectors, toothbrush holders. Both toothbrushes and toothbrush holders are new. I just got me a couple of shower caps. Because your girl is wearing weave. <laughs> nah, but I do got some shower caps when it's time for me to get in the shower. Um hand sanitizer. I know the hospital's going to have hand sanitizer, but this is going to be my travel hand sanitizer. Anybody who want to touch my baby will sanitize before they touch. Um, got some breast pads. Some more breast pads. I know y'all like, what you need breast pads for? You ain't wearing the bra. That's for the ride home. And then I just got us a little thing of toothpaste. We're going to be in the hospital two, three days max, as long as I don't have a C-section. Cross my heart and hope I don't. Um, this all in that side. And this side is where I have the most dry toiletry. Um, got two little loofahs. Lather builders, sponges, whatever you want to call them. One for me, one for him. Got a travel oil chain. Because I told y'all, your girl is wearing weave. And all this I think I got from Walmart. Yeah, all this did come from Walmart. Except for these. These came from, um... <sighs> can't think of the name, but they were only 27 or 29 cents. I got him a travel size deodorant. Like, I'm not packing much for him. I'm packing the necessities. Anything he does not bring on his own, he will not have. I got him a toothbrush and toothpaste and deodorant and a t-shirt. That's enough for me. Got me a travel size of thing I have to wash my face with. Got some pads from nine months ago. Yeah. I'll have to go and buy some more of those. Got me a travel size deodorant. That way I know we won't forget anything because I don't have to pack anything. It's all packed. I got my shea butter. Um, I actually just took a chunk out of a new one I bought. See? And just threw it in here. Because this one, as you can see, was empty. Uh, got a soap, soap holder with the bar of soap. This is just dial. Can't go wrong with dial. It's dial white. Antimicrobial, antibacterial. Can't ask for anything better. And just got a little bitty thing of cocoa butter just to keep me from being ashy. Excuse me. And then this pocket here. Okay, yeah. Uh, don't judge me. <laughs> I got me a can of purse. 
I got a snack. I'm still pregnant, so I'm still fat. And two new brain bars and the old honey. Another boy. So, that is my bag. From my bag, we can go ahead and go to her bag. I can fold this stuff up at a later second. This is her diaper bag. Got it at my baby shower. Um, I am going to put my little accordion that has all her like information. Even though the clinic I'm in now does not use it, I'm still going to take it. Okay. And as we unzip this, her bag is pretty much full. And this little thing, clear pouch. I'm bringing her a pair of shoes. Yeah. So these will be her coming home shoes. Got her a hat. Pair of socks. Um, I'm only bringing two washcloths. And then I just have a pacifier holder in her. I do plan on taking her out. Yes, taking her out the first day. Um, just to go see my, my great grandmother and my grandmother. Because she's not coming out for a very long time. So, might as well take her straight from the hospital to my granny house. So they can see her. And maybe to her dad's grandmother. Don't know yet. Um, got this little pouch. I think this is just in here because I'm going to keep it in here. Period. Just to have in her diaper bag. Period. This is little medicine stuff. Drivers ask to wear the fingernail clippers because. They said they don't give you clippers at the hospital. So, got her some fingernail clippers. Got the monitor, medicine phone. Like, that's just stuff for the long haul. I am taking her handprint and footprint thing. Even though, um, I think that even though this comes with ink, I want to get her fresh. I don't want her big feet print, her big handprint. I want her fresh out the womb print. So I'm bringing this, her fleece blanket, this was not washed, no it was not, um, like I packed our several outfits, this is one of the headbands that, um, I'm bringing, it might be too big for, but I'm bringing it anyway. Just a, like I said, we're going to my granny house. So, I do have a thing of wipes in here. Let's see this little corner. This corner here has... Hold on. These are actually in here by outfit. But I don't think they are still by outfit. So, let me try to get this together. I'm sorry, yeah. This was not um like something that I was planning on doing. Well, I was planning on doing, but I would have had it organized more. Okay. This here is our purple outfit. Got our purple flower headband. Her purple bib. This is in a newborn. It says, I love daddy with her little butterfly pants that are purple and with the long sleeves onesie that covers it. That's our purple newborn outfit, just in case we cannot fit newborn. Oh, and she's going to wear, yeah, this uh, sleep and play. 
out of the hospital with that purple outfit. You know, match, but I will. Then we have zero to three months. This is her pink outfit. Got her pink headband. Her zero to three months sleep and play. Don't know how big she's going to be. Um, just a white onesie. This is just a pink onesie. This is actually a zero to three months. I just grabbed it just to have that. Um, her pink bib. Her long sleeve heart onesie. And her long sleeve um, onesie that say I'm ready for my close up. And this is in a three month. Like I said, I don't know how big she's going to be, but looking at this now, I'm pretty much in fact, she will not be wearing this home. But in case she can't fit the newborn, she will wear this with these pink pants. So it'll be the pink pants. This onesie. With just a white onesie up under it. Her pink bib and her polka dot bunny sleep and play. That's if she can't fit her newborn outfit. Um, I have a thermal blanket, a flannel, burp cloth. Yeah, burp cloth. Um, my sling. Her um swaddling blanket and just another um flannel blanket like it's gonna be she we gonna be ready for whatever weather she gonna sweat <laughs> that's what's gonna happen um nothing in that pocket oh. Then on the inside, I got her just some little travel size, her shampoo, lotion, and body wash, and then a comb and a brush. The nurse, they don't supply you with those at the hospital either. And that is it for our hospital bags. So, like I said, this was not her diaper bag. This was her hospital bag and my hospital bag. Um, didn't think this video was gonna be that long, but it was. So, gonna wrap it up here. And if you guys have any questions about either one of our bags, um, wanna know why I'm not having something in there, or I got any input on what I should put in, just let me know. Leave it in the comments, and I will talk to you guys later on my next video.